Well, the Patrick Kane saga has finally come to an end as the decision is made. Patrick Kane will be a Detroit Red Wing. The official announcement, at least at the time of recording, has not been made, but Elliot Friedman, alongside other influencers like Chris Johnson, has said it is finished. Elliot Friedman specifically is putting it at $2.75 million for a one-year deal, which, hey, that's pretty damn good. Red Wings fans have to be very happy right now, and as a Rangers fan who was happy with Kane last postseason, but obviously not how things ended it up, I'm a little jealous. According to insiders, Kane had it narrowed down to several teams. For a while, Buffalo seemed likely near the end. It seemed to be between Florida and Detroit. Rumors were that he wanted a multi-year deal. Obviously, he didn't get that, but he does get to join his buddy Alex Dabrinkit, and I've got to imagine the two will get the pair. It'll take Kane some time to get into the swing of things with no games played and obviously no camp, but I mean, this is really low risk. 2.75, one year. I think if the cap Apokako injury had happened earlier, and if it's as serious as I fear it may be, the Rangers definitely would have been in on Kane at that price. As it stands now, Detroit's third in the Atlantic. They just rallied off big wins against the Devils, the Bruins, and the Wild. They will be playing the Rangers tomorrow. I doubt Kane will be ready for that. Expect him probably next week, maybe the Thursday game against the Blackhawks. The Red Wings is an interesting choice for me. I think they've got a great young team. I don't know if they're really cup contenders quite yet, but hey, I could be wrong. Red Wings fans, let me know what you think about this. And of course, everyone else, feel free to let me know as well. I'll talk to you guys soon.